Hey everybody, this is Sightless Senshi. For this first part of the video, I'm not going to be splitting them into two parts, or at least I'm going to try that and see how this works out. Um, for this first part of the video, I'm going to do a little section of, uh, let's do some lock talk. I'm going to talk a little bit about uh, the lock I'll be picking today. This is a pack lock. Uh, as you know, I got that uh, um, set of locks from the uh, eBay seller who was selling a bunch of military grade locks, and this is a military grade pack lock. Uh, Pacific Lock, I believe is the full name. Um, anyway, it's a really nice lock. Uh, very, very hefty, very sturdy. Uh, the bidding is not maybe as impressive as it could be on some other pack locks. It's pretty neutral. I have some with like some pretty radical biddings on here. Um, but it's a challenging lock nonetheless for me, so let's give it a try here in a minute. Let me show you the lock. Um, let's see, it is key retaining, so once it gets to, see it only turns, I've got to keep it on this thing with all these other keys, sorry about that, or I'll lose them. Uh, see it only turns throughout a 45 degree, and then your shackle comes out, so there you go. Um, and it is key retaining, so that's not coming out of there. Um, and then we'll get that in there, and there you go. Um, so since it only turns to a 45 degree, I have found that if I pick it to, um, in anything like this one where it goes to a 45, if I pick it, um past that, or I pick it, uh, and then it turns, if I turn it past the 45, of course, the, the shackle will not open, and that confused the crap out of me at first, I had to rotate it back, uh, to get it to open. Anyway, um, so I'm going to cut away and get this thing put up in the vise, and I'll show you that it's the same lock and that we're all good once it's up in the vise, and we'll, uh, have a look at, uh, how this works when I split the video into two parts. So, let's, uh, let's get to it then. Okay, everybody, let's uh, give this a shot. Uh, I tried picking it in the vise, actually, and I'm just going to take that cut out because it just didn't go so well. Um, I have had some luck picking this in hand before, so we're just going to give that a shot. Um, let's see. Uh, let me just confirm for you all that it's the same lock. We've got the same key. Um, let's pop that in there. Rotates exactly that 45 degrees, and that happens. So same lock, all that stuff. Nothing, nothing has been edited, not up to any funny business. Uh, yeah, I did not have a lot of luck with the vice. Uh, anyway, so we're going to do, uh, um, let's see, this uh, 50 thousandths uh, pry bar from Peterson, and this is a Sparrows offset uh, hybrid, they call it, and the handle was crafted by my girlfriend, uh, who just uploaded her first lock picking video under the YouTube username Lady Lock Picker. So definitely go check her out if you get the chance. She's got uh, some, a great video and hopefully even more to come. So anyway, let's go ahead and get in there. And I just stuck the tool in there for a second and already got a false set. So, or a little bit of movement. I don't know if it's necessarily a false set. But anyway, let's see what we've got here. I'm going to try and keep it nice and light with these pack locks. I never know what I'm about to get into. Some of them can be pretty tricky. And some of them not so much. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we got a nice deep uh, or deeper false set. Uh, if you're hearing any noises uh, on the ground, by the way, that's our dog. Uh, I got some counter rotation. That was good. That's good. And then picked that. Uh, guessing that was a spool pin. Um, let's see. Can I find any more exciting counter rotation? I like counter rotation. It's just a cool thing, and I'm a fan of it. See nothing toward the beginning. Oh. Is that, am I just picking off my tensioner? I think I am. Let me see. Yeah, I think I just moved my tensioner. Oh, hang on, hang on. There is something that feels like it wants to move. Oh, and, oh, that's just a false set. I thought I was gonna have an open there. A really, really deceptive false set that felt very good. Um, shame on you, Locke, for teasing me. It's a bad lock. All right, let's see. You know, it's a very good lock, actually. I'm, Really impressed with this thing. For military lock, I was hoping for, you know, some good challenge. Uh, let's see. Let's get this thing on. Ooh, there we go. There's a little something. Can we get some more of that? A little bit of counter rotation. Ah, dang it. Over, over did it there. See, it gets to a certain point, then it doesn't really. Oh. Yeah, dropped into a false set and then or dropped out of and into a false set again. Uh, seems like I've dropped some pins, so let's go back and repick one of those. Those are right here, and I think we have. Well, the tensioner fell loose, but 
we have an open. So there you go, guys. Pack lock. Um, some nice uh, pins in there. Not a very tricky bidding, but it was tricky enough to keep to keep me out for a while. Um, so this is pretty fun. Um, I really like picking this lock. Um, sorry, I had to do this in two cuts um, just to do like the talking section and then this. Uh, I'll try and see if I can get it down to one cut in the future, and we'll see how that all works out. Uh, all the same, I hope this is still acknowledged as a valid pick because this is the same lock. And uh, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see you again next time. Y'all have a good one.